My final talk in Las Vegas for Dr. Bill Morgan and Parker University is on the fundamental basic training elements or movement literacies that we all need in order to have sustainable activity and a sustainable health span throughout our lifespan. The gap between health and lifespan is growing larger and larger. Over 100 years ago, as we began to conquer infectious disease and infant mortality, lifespan began to increase dramatically. Until today, the average lifespan is almost 30 years longer than it was 100 years ago. But since 1990, health span has been shrinking. As Stephen Hawking said, the cause of most disease is very simple. We eat too much and move too little. And why it is more people don't understand this is beyond my comprehension. I will be explaining how squats, lunges, hinges, push, pull, and carry are the fundamental pillars, the movement patterns that we want to train. If we are to fulfill Dr. Carol Levitt's ideal of taking a functional rather than a structural approach, of focusing on the source rather than the site of symptoms, then to do this we must have a rubric. We must be able to know what we're focusing on when we're trying to prepare people for more and more stress. Frailty is on the rise, falls are on the rise, and disabling arthritis and back pain are also increasing almost exponentially. In my first talk, I explained how it was that we could have a scalable approach based on four principles. In my second talk, how we can make this precise, N equals one, by identifying each person's individual demands and capacity shortfall. And in this third talk, I will present how we bridge the gap. Again, it is my honor to speak in Las Vegas for Parker University and Dr. Bill Morgan, and I'm extremely grateful for this opportunity. Thank you very, very much.